Hey, I'm Mark Oldman, Pottery Barn wine expert and author of Oldman's Brave New World of Wine. Let's talk about al fresco wine. Drinking wine outside, whether it's a picnic or you're just kind of lollygagging around the swimming pool, I have four Jack Cellars wines, Sauvignon Blanc, Chardonnay, a Merlot, and a Cabernet. To start with the Sauvignon Blanc, this is called Charmed. It's a Jack Cellars wine. So when you smell it, mmm, that's like the typical Sauvignon Blanc, uh, I call it a citric snack. It's lemony, it's grapefruit. This is a great outdoor wine. I mean, you could imagine having, you know, some mozzarella and tomato with a nice tangy wine like this. So, Charmed from Jack Cellars, a great outdoor wine. Then we have a Chardonnay. This is Her Majesty Chardonnay. Some Chardonnays can be like Las Vegas. They can be just over the top. Good to visit, very temporarily, but you don't want to stay too long. This, on the other hand, is a restrained oak Chardonnay. It's got oak, it's got that vanilla topping. Let's check this out. It's got some smokiness to it. It's got some vanilla on the nose, but when you taste it, it doesn't assault your senses. It's restrained. It's nicely balanced for a California Chardonnay. Richer foods on your picnic, it would be delicious with. Uh, also, just great alone as kind of a sipping wine. So a nice Chardonnay is very good al fresco also. Next up for your al fresco needs, bone dance. This is a Merlot. And when you check out the Merlot here, you smell plums. I also get kind of some black olives in there. It's, co it's complex, but it's also, it's juicy, it's likable. It's got very little bitterness. And thus, it's great for the outdoors and just kind of hanging out. That's a summertime red right there, but with a little bit of complexity, which is very good. Finally, if you really want to pull out the stops. You're dining outdoors and you want something very special, go for this high roller Cabernet. I smell this Cabernet and it's like, it's like big mountain grown Napa Cabernet, black currants, tobacco leaf, maybe a little edge of mintiness, which is very characteristic of Napa Cabernet. But then you taste it and it's, not over the top. It's restrained for a Napa Cabernet. It's balanced. In the wine world, we say a wine like this has finesse. So High Roller from Jack Sellers. This is a good special occasion al fresco Cabernet Sauvignon. So there you have it. Four wines that are great for dining al fresco. Um, really fun and simple varieties. You don't have to learn too much. They will offer immediate pleasure. If you want to find out more about them, go to PotteryBarn.com. If you want to find out more about wine in general, go to my website, MarkOldman.com, or check out my book, Oldman's Brave New World of Wine. And as I say in the book, remember, most importantly, when it comes to wine, drink bravely.